Hey everybody, Josh here from Android Central, and I just wanted to take you guys through the first couple of levels of a game I found. It's called Roboto, and it's actually brand new in the Android market. In Roboto, you play as, surprisingly enough, Roboto, who is a skateboarding robot on a quest to find the lady robot from the title screen. The gameplay is a side-scroller, so it definitely harkens back to an older time, much like Mario or Sonic the Hedgehog with a little bit of Mega Man thrown in just because of the cannon action you just saw. You collect power-ups along the way like those blue orbs that recharge your blue meter in the top left corner of the screen. The more energy you have in your energy meter, the more shots you can fire and also the longer you can hover. There is no double jump in the game but there is a hover on your hover skateboard and you can actually wall jump if you tap the jump while you're right next to a wall. Seeing that this is a game about robots and it's assumed to be in the future, there are some nifty new mechanics like reverse gravity every time you pass one of these purple portals like you just saw. There are also three big gears per level and I think you've seen me pick up all three. When you collect all three gears you get a score bonus when you complete a level just like I'm doing right now. Something that struck me right off the bat from the first time I opened up Roboto and this isn't my first time I've actually done the first three levels to get a bit of practice is that the graphics are absolutely top-notch. For an Android game, we typically don't get this many games that have this level of polish when it first comes out, and also it's just utterly and completely responsive. The load times are close to nothing when you're going from level to level, which is still fresh to me and definitely welcome. Also, the touchscreen controls, the jump and fire buttons are dead-on responsive. I think something that a lot of us at Game on Android have noticed is that the joystick isn't as accurate as it could be, and fortunately for Roboto, that doesn't seem to be the case. I've said it before, and I'll say it again, I could not be more impressed with the quality of this game. It's called Roboto, it's in the Android market, and if you enjoy any kind of retro side-scroller or just want to try out a new, really quality Android game, this is definitely one that I would take a look at.